welcome. Thank you, Howard. All right, good to see you. What's your name? My name is uh, Mike Super. Mike Super. Yeah, that's my real name, believe it or not. So, Mike Super, tell us what you do and, and a little bit about yourself. I'm a mystifier. A mystifier. Yeah, a little different than a magician. Trying to use people's minds and their energy. And uh, tonight, I'm going to introduce you to something uh, pretty unique. All right. Well, I'm anxious to see what you do. I wish you the best of luck. Oh, thank you, Howard. All right, real good. Let's see what you got. I was hoping I could uh, borrow one of the judges. Heidi. Yes? Would you help me on stage? Go ahead, Howard. Big round of applause. How are you doing? I'm good. I don't know if I'm going to like this. No, don't worry. Now, it's important, Heidi, you and I did not prearrange anything. No. Okay, this is where it gets serious. Uh, Heidi, I, uh, I have here an item. We're going to use this glass pitcher, but before we even begin, I don't want people to think this is sugar glass, okay? Okay? Okay. Uh, are you right or left-handed? Right. Okay, that's your dominant hand. Hold that with your right hand. I also have here a clear plexiglass chamber for any skeptics in the audience. I don't want anybody to think there's any external influences on what we're about to do. Okay. I'm going to introduce you to my imaginary friend from when I was a kid. Uh, Heidi, his name is Desmond. I know it sounds strange. He's with me here tonight, and I would like to introduce all of you to my spirit energy, Desmond. Okay. Including you, Heidi. But I need you all to be open to it. Are you open to meeting Desmond? Good. I want to meet Desmond. Heidi, yes. we're going to isolate that picture. What I'd like you to do is you're going to insert it. See how there's a space for your wrist? Don't let it touch the sides. Don't let it touch the bottom. All right. Desmond is going to feed off of our energy, audience. Rub your hands together like this. Good. On the count of three, we're going to release the energy towards Heidi. Heidi, Desmond will contact us in one of three ways. You'll feel a temperature change. You may feel the pitcher get heavy. And best case scenario, you will actually see an orb, a ball of light near Heidi's shoulder. Oh, right, my God. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, ready? One, two. And Heidi, be open to it. Desmond, give us a sign you're here. And three. Do it again, do it again. Ready, Heidi? I'm ready. Be open to it, I'm be open. open to it. Ready? One, two, three. Desmond, give us a sign you're here. Ah! Give Heidi a big round of applause. Hello. Hello there. What's your name? James Moore. How old are you, James? I'm 24. Is this what you do full time or do you have a day job? This is now full time for me. I've been doing it. It's a bit of magic since I was eight. Simon loves magic. I know how much he loves it. I do like magic when it's good. Okay. Okay. Best of luck. Definitely going to say yes. Four big fat yeses. Congratulations. Hello. Hello. 
Uh, what's your names? Brynolf and Young. We're here to do uh, a card trick for you. All right, best of luck. Thank you. Thanks. It's time for the world's most difficult card trick. By taping Peter's head and thereby blocking most of Peter's... Oh, that's going to hurt his hair when he takes that off. That was hurt when he takes that off. To find the card that you, David, will select in a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, this is entertainment. <laughs> Basically, it's a card trick, so I brought a deck of cards. Uh, I would like you to pick one and then sign it with your name across the face of the card. Okay. Okay? So anyone will do. Okay. So got one? Great. Sign it. Amanda, we also need a number between 5 and 15. Out loud, please. 12. 12? That's a great number. <laughs> okay. I've done it. Yeah, let me have the card, please. Because of the signature, your card is unique. There's only one card in the world that looks exactly like this. Peter? Let's go. Now, despite all the tape covering Peter's head, he will use his amazing sleight of hand abilities to find your card, shuffle it around a bit so it ends up on exactly position number 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Ladies and gentlemen, the world's most difficult card trick. Uh, okay, you missed you, you, you it slightly. Peter, it wasn't even close. Now, here, here comes the interesting part. Peter, a pair of scissors. The first thing we did was to tape Peter's head. After that, you selected a card which you signed, which means that there's only one card in the world that looks exactly like that. Ladies and gentlemen, the world's most difficult card trick. That's impressive. Thank it you. Will be it. How can it be? It? Well, it will be because the camera. Look, look, you can see. Here you go. Is that the one? That is my card. Oh, my Thank God. you. <laughs> okay, Simon, how do you yeah, buzz? I shouldn't have buzzed, actually, to be, f to be fair. Uh, I just thought you'd got it wrong. Yeah, I have to apologise for buzzing. Like, Simon, I thought there was a mistake. I'm quite surprised that two people are so thick they didn't realise it was a... It was... You were, you were telling us a dummy. <laughs> Um, Thicko number one, what do you think? <laughs> uh, I'm going to say yes. <laughs> no, no, no. It is, uh, it's a yes from me, it was brilliant, well done. Thicko number two. <laughs> <laughs> it's a yes from me. you got four yeses, boys, well done. Yeah. Yeah. Using spray paint, I'm going to predict something about one of you judges right now. As you know, I'd love to join you at the table. Would that be okay? Yeah. Howard, you can see that the cards are not only mixed up and shuffled, but more importantly, they're all different. Is that right? That is correct. Heidi, yeah. I want you to choose one of these at random, simply by pushing your finger into the deck as I riffle through. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. Any way you want. Right there, you sure? <laughs> what? <laughs> is that the one you want? Yes. Yeah. Positive. You can change it if you like. No, I don't want to change it. Take it. My mind. Take it. That'll be for you. Don't show it to me, but look at it yourself, and please remember it and show it to everyone at home. Where is everyone at home? <laughs> remember that card. See, back on stage, my prediction is already locked in. No peeking. My question is, Heidi. Yes. Do you have the two of diamonds? No, I don't. No. no. You don't have the two of diamonds no, right now. No, I don't. Now. So, I don't. Ho hold on a second. Uh, maybe I can fix this. Watch. <sighs> Ten of spades, is that you? Is that right? But hold wow. on, my friends. See, here at Radio City Music Hall, there's really no room for mistakes. And my first guess was the two of diamonds and I thought maybe you would have that one but hold on see 
Howie, you didn't even choose a card, is that right? Uh, yeah, no, yes, but, <laughs> I don't, I'm not part of this. But Howie, one card chose you. What are you talking about? This is gonna sound a little crazy. <laughs> Already does. Obviously, I couldn't have touched you. Please stand. No! Stand! Really? Howie, reach into your, your left back pocket right now. Tell us what you find. Hold it up. What do you do? The two of diamonds? The two of diamonds? No, I'm telling you. Wow! Thank you so wow. much. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's see you do what you do. Am, am I allowed to go closer to you guys? You can, yes. All right, thank you very much. You're welcome. Now, the thing about bar magic as opposed to regular magic is the fact that I don't use big props. I don't, I can't afford them. <laughs> and that's Whoa. all I have to Why dazzle the world. Right. Now, the thing about magic that happens close to your face is that it has to be performed exquisitely. If I can pronounce that word correctly, but. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Just cut the card. But honestly, I whoa. whoa. Just do not like card tricks because Stop that's it. amazing. But Stop where are you coming from? But I have a beautiful six-year-old son, and um, I want to do something to you, Miss Mel. B. Oh wow. Well, that my little boy likes. Can I see your hand? The other side. Thank you. Oh, perfect. I'm gonna take this ball, put it right about here. I want you to hold that ball real tight for me. Thank you. With that ball there and that ball there, we're gonna go abracadabra. Open up your hand. Oh. Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! Let me mentally assault you two on the other hands. <laughs> because, because I am ghetto. Whoa. Thank you. Not my name, though. <laughs> that is the name. Whoa! Wowza. Oh! Thank you. 